Okay, so I am back doing another one of the Fat Finger demos and I want to do this in response to a video that somebody was else was making about some of the problems um, with using a literate programming thingamajigger. Okay. I'll try another that. Okay. I don't know, it's also complaints about the there was also been some complaints about the what's it called the the terminal that I was using now, so I switched over. And also, might be a little bit loud because I have a new keyboard. Okay, so one of the complaints about uh, using a literate example is debugging. So let's take a look at UI tweaks. Uh, I have this mode line thing which I want to do one day, but so menu bar mode. And we've already had this set up, so when I save, it's going to tangle it. Don't know why that happened. And let's go back into our init. Let's see what we got here. So what we just did was we had the menu menu bar mode, and we see that here it does negative one. Now I'm going to turn on what's it called? Um, Oh, that was weird. And let's also make this a little bit bigger. A little bit, a little bit smaller. Okay. No, oh, that's fine. Okay. So here we've got menu bar mode is sent to negative one. So it, it should never come on. Let's go back to our middle uh, One of the things that I want to show you is here that we put in the comments. I have no web. Let's change this to yes. Yes. Usually you're not, when you first start, you're not gonna have this type of thing. What it'll, I think on our, when I first did it, I did. And what this is gonna do is it's gonna make that you have that you have these comments here. And what these comments do is they allow you to jump back to the org mode, the org mode file that you use to create this. So this helps with debugging, but it also has another feature which I'm going to show in a second. First, let's see how that works. Let's see. Org. Tangle. And jump to org, and that will go back to where we were. Tango, jump, torque. Yeah, and you see it takes me back to the uh, to where I was. And we can do. Should have taken me back to where I was, but it didn't. Okay, so. Right, this weird buffer here because of fat fingers. Okay, now what's the interesting here is that say that we went into the debugger and debugger throw us into this thing and I say wait a minute uh, so that's not right menu bar mode should be on and we see now the menu bar or super menu bar came back I saved it now what I can do is I can do org org babel 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 uh, tangle or uh, detangle and you see what it did here, the code that I wrote in the in the in the actual in the elis file, put it back into into the code here, which is really cool. Put it back in the right place. Now there are some things that aren't going to work with this, so I'll show you in a second. Let's put this back off. Don't need that in bar mode. No, why it's Probably have some weird code going on here. Turn that back off and hit that EL. And we see that our minus one is there again. Yep. Very cool stuff. It's not, doesn't, there's not really much more to it than that. You can change code directly in here. 
and it'll sh go back into your org mode file. Uh, the only thing that you need to be aware of is that it needs to be inside of inside of these comments to tell you where it goes. So say if I was going to put something, uh, I don't know. So here it says menu bar mode ends here, right? So that, so if I put in something now like, uh, uh, I don't know, toolbar, toolbar mode. And we also want to make sure the toolbar mode is off. Now, uh, I'm not going to go each, it's not going to do anything here, but if I try and run org babble detangle here, I'm just going to kill this buffer and reopen it so you can see that. Just for kicks, let's do it again. They said detangle 10 code blocks. And right here is where that weird code would have been. But it's not there. Where the when I turned off the what's it called? Um when I turned off the why can't I remember uh, the toolbar. Now if I retangle this and I go back into init the EL, what you'll see is that that is gone now. The thing where I turned off the toolbar. So that's something you need to be made aware of. Uh, what you could do is you could always add it in here. I could do toolbar mode uh, uh, negative one. We can save this, and then if I do. Uh, what is it you're trying to? Now let's see. And here I came in to the uh, file here, and I could add, add it into another block and then save it, and that should work. But detangling is pretty cool, especially if you're working in debugging. You want to fix something on the fly, and you want to keep your things synced up. That should work for you fine. And so that's really, there was nothing for me to, no code for me to save here. That was just to show off this feature. Now, in a second, I'm going to show another feature, but I'm going to do that in another video. So, call two for now.